What's up, everybody? This is T.224NYC. Today is Build Saturday. So we're going to be running through a couple of uh, build reviews today. Uh, this one is an oldie but goodie. Uh, recently was uh, updated. Uh, it's in the Pyramid Wizard. This is the Tomb Raider build. Overall, it's a really good build for the most part. This build is uh, definitely Fire Stick approved. Um, it's a fairly small build. But it does have some unique attributes to the build. Um, so we start here in the TV show section. Uh, down below, you can search by networks. This is uh, coming from Exodus. We have Specto TV, Zen TV, Salt, uh, Exodus TV, Aries, and we have a TV box set. What's really nice about this is if you were to click up, you actually do get the widget. The widget is not ever floating up there, so you kind of have to engage it. You just by, by pressing the up button, <clears throat> and then it has the uh, the widget for the uh, most popular TV shows that are currently in Zen. If you click up again, this is actually coming from Exodus. Um, you can actually search by TV networks as well. So I thought that was pretty nice. Uh, also. The one thing I don't like the um, the UI input noise that it makes. I'm pretty sure that can be disabled somewhere within the settings menu. Scrolling from left to right, the next category is going to be the pyramid. Um, as I mentioned before, this build is coming from the pyramid wizard. So they have a DocuZone, KidZone, uh, LiveZone, Webcam Zone, Music Zone, uh, Cody Zone. I don't know what any of these are. Let me take a look and see what the Cody Zone is. Oh, so these are, I guess, uh, the most popular YouTube channels. Hopefully one day my channel will be listed in this list. It's wishful thinking. This one does have a sub menu as well. Coming from the pyramid streams, uh, box sets, new releases, popular, uh, top 250 IMDB, chick flicks, and horror movies. And they actually have the floating wizard up above as well. Next section is going to be the movie section. We have Salt's Movies, Real Movies, Fine and Dandy, Sky Movies, Specto, Zen, Exodus, and Pyramid. Up above, same as before, we have the uh, most popular movies available. Pretty nice background here. The background does change based on whatever movie you're hovering over. And this does not have, it only has one widget. So there's no widget that's above this. Next section, sports section. Sub menu down below, we have boxing hits, red duck. Follow, follow, Celtic FC, Motorsports, NBA, uh, the classic pro sport. This one does include Project B, which is good. There's no widget or sub menu included in this category. Next, we have live sports, NJM Soccer, Find My Game, which is a great, great, great add on for sports. basically shows all the sports that are on right now. That UI noise makes me want to bash my head into this table. This one does have a live widget up top.
top add-ons, we have uh, Bob, Phoenix, Stream Army, Release Hub, Skynet. We're going to be doing a review on that add-on as well. Um, coming from Phoenix, 1242415. I always stumble on that one. White Devil, Wolfpack, Hollow TV, C Cloud, Vortex, and Titan, UK Turks, Goodfellas, and Evolve. They have a kid zone. Okay, let me check and see. I actually do have a widget in this one as well. We have Kid Zone, Disney Super Cartoons, Toon Mania, Kids 2, and this has a uh, floating wizard also. This movie, A Dog's Purpose, was actually pretty good. Um, we recently got a new addition to the family. It's a little dog, so it's, it's, it was pretty good. They have an extra section, which includes documentaries, IMDb Top 300, UK Vehicle Check, Final Gear, Echo Dogs, Gym World. They have a favorite section. That does come with a widget as well. Nice music section. This is uh, where all of the add-ons are. Here you can access the wizard uh, maintenance, any build updates that are available. And you can donate to the developer if you choose. Settings menu. I wanted to see if there's a way to disable this. So this is the uh, the GUI sound. So you can have Cody sounds, or you can set it to none. I'm going to select the Cody sounds because that is awful. And then we have a uh, power section. Typical settings in there. We actually have a live TV section as well. Overall, a really, really solid build. Um, definitely an option uh, for the Fire Stick users and someone who's in search of a uh, complete and light build. Um, I really, really enjoy this one. My son is actually um, the one who found these guys. Um, so yeah, he's he's actually showed this to me probably about a week ago or so. So he's actually been using this build. And it's been performing because he actually only has the, uh, the fire stick in his bedroom. Um, so he he's into the light and fast builds uh, for Cody 17 uh, Krypton. So if you like this one, I'm gonna quickly show you how to install this thing. Okay guys, so I'm gonna show you how, in, how to uh, install this thing. Uh, the first thing that you're gonna wanna do is, in, as I always say, it has to be a fresh uh, install of Cody. First thing that you're gonna wanna do is uh, hit the settings icon Jump into File Manager, select Add Source, click where it says None. And then you're going to want to add the URL. It's http colon forward slash forward slash pyramid dot net any dot net forward slash repo. Uh, once you get it in, go ahead and hit OK. And I'm just going to name it
You can give it any name you want, guys. Hit the back button, back again, click on add-ons, select this open box in the top left, select install from zip. You may get this pop-up. If you do, jump into settings, and you're going to enable unknown sources. Then go ahead and say yes. Hit the back button again, install from zip again, click whatever you named it. You're going to click on the uh, repository Tomb Raider. You'll get a pop-up that says the Tomb Raider repo has been enabled. Once you get that pop-up, go ahead and select install from repository. Click the Tomb Raider repo. Program add-ons. And you're going to launch the and install the Tomb Raider wizard. Select the option to install. <clears throat> it'll quickly download and then just click on it again. And then it'll bring you to this page. If it doesn't, if you don't get this pop up for Tomb Raider wizard, that's okay. Go ahead and click this option here to open. But since I got the pop up, I'm going to go ahead and hit continue. You're going to jump into the build menu. Looks like it didn't open for me. You can go ahead and click bills. And I'm going to select the adult version. Uh, even, let's keep it rated G. I'm going to go ahead and keep it uh, rated G. And select the uh, the family or the version without uh, the adult content. Click on it. I don't have to do a fresh install because this is a brand new install of Kodi. I'm just going to do the standard install. Select yes to install. That's pretty much it, guys. Uh, Cody's going to download uh, from the Tomb Raider wizard the build. Uh, once it downloads, it's automatically going to extract it in your, into your Cody. Um, the only thing that you have to do after the extraction is force close your Cody. Once you force close it, just go ahead and reopen it. And then uh, it'll automatically open. Uh, into the uh, the Tomb Raider build. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video, guys. Um, if you did enjoy the video, uh, please don't forget to share it, like it, and subscribe to the channel. Uh, we're going to be doing a couple of more, a few more reviews over the weekend uh, within this wizard. There's a couple of builds that really, really jumped out at me. Um, on this one. So again, this is T.224NYC from Stream Kings. You guys have a great weekend and it's going to be build crazy weekend this weekend. We're going to do build after build after build review um, of the five, six or seven builds that I'm going to be reviewing this weekend. There's got to be something for everybody uh, in the content that I'm showing you guys. So uh, we'll be seeing you soon, probably later on today. I got to go out to dinner with the family. So we're going to do that and that's about it. I'll see you on the next one.